morning, 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 and welcome to the early hours of the morning in the Maasai Mara. My name is Brent Leo Smith. I have Dangerous Dave Easter on camera, and we're with the Purungat Pride around Lookout Hill. We woke up to a major cacophony of noise as a male lion was fighting with these three females that are now leading their cubs away, and there's a herd of wildebeest stampeding towards them. Look at that, you can see all the wildebeest in the background. Now, of course, it is completely pitch black here. Yeah? And you can see them getting closer. Look, look at the female in front, she's jogging up into the wildebeest. I'm going to try and move a little bit closer. We are quite far behind them. Hold on, Dave. Hold on, everyone. Remember, this is 100% live from Kenya. We went from asleep to awake listening to the lions fight. And now it looks like the girls are going on the hunt. There's a mass of wildebeest still streaming. We've lost sight of the third lioness. She was right up in front. There's a second lioness running now. Now we've got to be very careful. There are masses of, of warthog holes and rocks out here. So you can see the two cubs there. Oh, something's going on up here, Dave. Oh, have they missed? Just stay a bit wider, please. Look, there's all the bees running right next to them. Remember, we don't know where one of the lionesses is. There, there, there you go. Look, there she is. There's another lioness. So I need to get closer. Yep. So we're getting right to the edge of our infrared light. I think the girls are off to the left a bit. There they are, there they are. Is that a line? Yes, that's all the lines. Oh, well, not all. We're missing one adult female. We don't know where she is. I can see they're still nervous after encountering that nomadic male. Okay, there's a, just come wide again. There's another stream of wildebeest, it sounds like. I remember we were working off our ears here. We don't want them to get out of our infrared light because then we will lose them. I think they might have failed in their attempt there, but let's just keep up for a bit longer. We've got them. They've just gone over the ridge. Janine wants to know what pride this is. This is the Purungat pride. Uh, I think some people call them the lookout pride as well. If you got them, Dev, they're gone. Oh, they've moved into some long grass. I, I got them. Straight ahead of me, I think. I saw, yes, there they are. suddenly got quite chilly as well this morning, hasn't it, Dave? 
So we were having a little a little nap on the vehicles and uh, all of a sudden all hell broke loose and these three females absolutely got the better of this male we didn't get the best look at him it sounds like there's more wildebeest ahead just come wider a bit please I can see if there's wildebeest there they are you can see them streaming across Now again, we've lost sight of two of the lionesses in the long grass. Now they might be a little bit nervous because of that male being around. Although they sent him packing about a kilometer and a half back. Just see those wildebeest eyes in the background. Where are the other lions? Ah, Sally says, so the cubs are staying with the adults for the hunt. Well, I think it's also just that everyone's a bit nervous after that random male popped up. I think they probably think they're a big enough distance away now. Now I really wish I knew where the other two girls are. You can just hear that noise of all the wildebeest in the distance. Now we've been listening to that all night long. I think there's a bit of relief going on at the moment to avoid it. To have avoided that attack from that male. It all happened so quickly in a matter of seconds they were up and there was just claws and teeth and growling. Holly says she's thoroughly enjoying getting to see these broadcasts at night. Oh, she's coming straight towards us now. Now she's looking back in the direction where we've just come from. Oh, that's my head, sorry. I cannot see her at all. She's right next to me. I can hear the cubs pattering along after her, just this tuk -tuk 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 through the grass. Stick on her, Dave. Which one? Stick on there. Is another adult? Mm, cab, cab, let's stick on. Okay. Hello, little fatty. Now, they killed a wildebeest sometime yesterday. Um, and it's pretty much over now. Okay, it looks like they've abandoned the hunt. Let me just see where they're going. Sheila is wondering how far are the wildebeest now? Um, they're probably still only five, six hundred meters away. Dave, do you have them? To the right. Oh, 
boy, this is going to be fun trying to find them in this long grass. This side. Back. Oh dear, they have just done a va vanishing act. I think they've given up on the hunt. We're going to try find them again. So stay tuned. You never know when we're going to be back. So goodbye from Dave and myself.